Hello, my dudes. So today I'm gonna wash my car, my dirty, dirty car. Um, it's summertime. It was super hot, and I, I thought, you know what? I'll just wash my car. So this is a vlog of washing my car. So I headed down to the local uh, petrol pump, um, Chevron, if you guys know about it. Um, and I thought I'll do an automatic car wash. Usually there is another uh, place far away where you put like four dollars quarters in and they give you unlimited water and pretty much everything for you to clean it within four minutes um i usually do that but um i thought this would be a fun cool video to shoot so here's the car wash so basically you go to a petrol pump and you just stand there and then you select options for the car to wash the car before me is doing something similar where the water just comes and puts the soap um, then there's like microfibers wiping the car and that's it boom voila done so uh, I'm gonna do the same thing as you can see you can't really see much because uh, my car is dirty the windows are dirty as well and it's also a sunny day so it's glaring a lot but before me you can see the water just spraying over there and uh, doing its a uh, thing and uh, yeah that's pretty much it so pretty simple you put the money in and where do you actually put the money right here right here just before you enter um you put the money right here so there's like seven dollar six dollar nine dollars and ten dollars option pretty much options all over and um, you can add in premium deluxe um put in the wax not put in the wax pretty much everything and the one thing that i hate about these car washes is that if you don't have money we realize you accidentally don't have the required change or you forgot to get your debit card you can't really go back so it's very 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 tricky because um car washes like these are usually very crowded um and today is a sunday so i just went in and you know it's it's crowded as the f so you know you can't really go um outside um once you change your mind so yeah um there are lots of guidelines i've been through this so many times but I'm just going to tell it out, out to you guys basically lower the antenna if you have an antenna fold your mirrors but I'm not going to fold my mirrors because I'm a rebel yeah um uh that's pretty much a good thing or a bad thing sometimes but I'm going to guess it's a good thing um you pretty much can't see anything over here it's super dark yeah that's the amount of cars that are behind me um, there's about two cars. I'm probably backed up all the way to the petrol pump to the street. Anyways, I'm just rambling around at this point. Um, so yeah. Um, oops, that's a Range Rover. So anyways, I'm not going to fold the mirrors. I'm just going to leave it like that. Uh, because the mirror is dirty as well. So it's been like around three months since I cleaned my car. Why didn't I clean my car? Well, that's a great question. Well, because it was raining a lot um, since the last time I went and I was like, you know what, the rain's going to clean it, right? Because if the rain's there, uh, I'm going to just go look stupid for cleaning that. So I'm just going to close my window Let's and go. it's go time. Right. I pretty much need to go when the signal is green. Uh, I don't want to dash into the car. So. Come on, yep. it's taking forever. Here comes the waterworks, I guess. Okay, this is scary. Ta -da! I'm gonna put it on brake hold so that I don't move. Scary. So this is the soapy water. So now here you see the instructions again it's super dark so it's the pre-soak time hub scrub clear coat dry foam spot rinse and then you drive ahead so uh, right now it's just putting the water and soap solution 
Okay, I'm just stopping up. Usually when you're like too far ahead, it says to back up. So you just follow the instructions right there. Drive ahead, stop, back up. So right now I'm stopping and I'm waiting for the waterworks. Seriously. What's the next place again? Okay. Water! So I just realized that the car wash is over, like this part is the dry part. Uh, well it just lasted for a minute and I'm like what the hell, like what is going on? Um, so if you can see towards my right there's a timer going on so I'm just waiting there uh, and I'm gonna definitely ask um, the car wash people what's up with this, um, you know, this car wash thing. It's like super insane. I mean. I'm just really frustrated at this point like this has never happened to me well check out this car like just check it out look how dirty it is like seriously this marks never existed before um, and now it's like super dirty like all these skid marks and it's just gross so I'm just gonna go ahead and ask horrible job the car wash did and I got another one so I just have to enter this code and I'm good so it's very important to give feedback to people when they need it even when they do a dirty job just don't drive away just ask for another one so you might get another one so there you go so sometimes you got to show your angry face to get things done anyways I went back in there and told them that the machine wasn't working uh, to my surprise a lot of people just went off like they didn't actually go ahead and complain so it's very important for you guys if you're like dissatisfied with something or some service is not up to the standard that you sort of expected it's very important to give feedback i know it's sometimes like um very grouchy and you know like uh, people don't really welcome that but do your part sometimes you know you can get a free car wash like i did right now so i'm waiting for my turn so it took me a close to 20 minutes uh, for my turn yes just because I complain doesn't mean I'm privileged I could actually uh, cut the line but yeah I had to wait um, so I'm waiting for this person to finish uh, fun story is that this person is like 80 years old she, it's her first time in the car wash according to the guy and she did not know how to like get in there and all that stuff so it was fun watching um that uh, just some bit of entertainment along with listening to the radio you can still see my window is so stained even though i just had a old car wash like just a few minutes ago you can pretty much see that this the previous car wash did nothing so yeah um just any day any time now lady just move move head so yeah um car wash um Okay, it's my turn so it's finally says drive ahead and this person about ahead of me still hasn't moved like seriously what the hell uh move move okay so i need to think i need to show my angry face to a lot of people today anyways 
um, this time I am going to be cautious. So here comes the water work. This part is like damn amazing. Like I love this part. And then um, notice how different the sequence is. Like first we had the soapy water, then the high pressure water, and then we just walked away, drove away. As in this time it's a little different. I think it's gonna be a lot more sequences. So I'm just waiting for the next uh, part. Okay, here comes the soapy Soap water. Solution. Just what I thought. Soapy water. Okay, so soapy water. Like and for now, I've just used the same option as before. So it does have a bit of wax, but Here I don't know how, um, you know how it's part, gonna so go ahead with this. So here comes a microfiber dabbing. I love this part. I just like. Uh, this is why they say to fold your mirrors because the intensity can be like really, really, really bad. So it goes like. You can just hear it right there. So I'm just like, you know, waiting for it to get over. It's like a salsa dancer spinning and spinning and spinning. happened it still says stop there's some more steps left okay the wash bar it looks much cleaner now this is which step you are so I think something's broken but the second attempt looks good to drive ahead Obviously, you can see there are no spots here. It's clean, but I can, I can sort of raise it. I don't think it's it's still broken, if you ask me. But still, a better job than the first time. So. 